Deacon. Hey. Is everything okay? What's wrong? Uh, actually, that's not why I'm here. Okay. Came by to see if there's anything you need for the uh, infirmary. Actually, we're running low on everything. I mean, we could always use more meds, sterile bandages, instruments. Uh, here. Hmm. A Liston knife. Yeah, it was used by doctors in the Civil War to perform operations in the field. Operations? Yeah, you know, when they didn't have any anesthesia or laudanum. I wrote down where you might be able to find one. <laughs> it's the brochure for the visitor center at Sherman Sherman's camp. camp yeah, yeah, the plate's crawling with all the freakers. I'll see what I can do. Yeah, uh, Deacon. Thank you. Chopper that. Yeah, 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 I know, okay, but first, you gotta do something for me. Wait, what? You need something from me? Look, there's a digital display on your radio. I'm going to send you a coded message in coordinates. You need that location. O'Brien, what the hell is this all about? Here it is. Visitor's center. Gotta find a way inside. Oh! <laughs> 
escape. Down here. Not much left. This place has been picked over clean. Liston knife. This is it. Gotta get it back to Addy. Daddy, I got that knife you were looking for. Thank you, David. You have no idea how bad we need this. No problem. Glad to help. that knife you were looking for. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Oh, look at all this power up. Be here late. I'm here. Jesus, don't... Don't sneak up on me like that. Did you find anything out about Sarah, about the woman that I put on your chopper? Nothing. Nothing? Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. It's gonna take some time, okay? I'm risking my neck here. If anyone the, the back at HQ finds out, the, the, those guys with the guns over there... You're all on the without same question. team, O'Brien. Just looks that way. Look, I don't have time to explain it right now, but... It's why I need your help. My help? Just, look, just take it. It's a, it's a wavelength recorder and some GPS trackers. I just need you to... We're out of time. Look, I... Shit, I don't even know your name. Deacon, Deacon St. John. Well, look, Deacon St. John, if you want me to risk my neck helping you find whatever her name... Uh, Sarah? Then, yeah, I'm gonna need you to do something for me. Let's go. Keep the radio close. 
I'll contact you in a couple of minutes. You don't even know my name? Oh, you're gonna know it before we're done, O'Brien. And keep the radio close. It's been right here the whole time, you son of a bitch. Jesus Christ, how long do I have to wait now? Hello? Are you there, Deacon? Yeah, I'm here. Now, what's this all about? What do you want? All right, I put a blocker on this channel. It's secure. What do you want? I've sent a series of coordinates to your radio. I need you to go to those locations. What? Why? Then why don't you ask them? I can't. Look, I said it's a long story and I don't have time to get into it right now. Let's just say the men above me, way above me, are running a lot of field missions, all separate from each other. Nobody knows what anyone else is doing. So the world ends and you assholes carry on like nothing's changed. Where? I sent you the coordinates. Okay, Jesus, over. Oh all right, I will see what I can do. LZs, landing sites, sample drop-off locations. Yeah, yeah, I got it, but you better have something for me, O'Brien. Yeah, yeah, I got it too. Hold on. Here, what are you, uh... One of our helos is heading towards your position now. You have to follow it. Follow it? Why? Just go! Don't lose it! Jesus, okay. All right. What's going on, O'Brien? Why am I out here in the shit chasing choppers down for you? Their destination's classified. I'm locked out of their files. So I can't give you the coordinates to the LZ. You have to follow them in. Jesus, don't you guys have spy, spy satellites? Shit like that? Then not that I have access to, no. I told you I'm Locked out. Yeah, I heard you. Please don't lose them. Ugh. All right, where the hell you boys fly off to, huh? Come on now, can't let him get too far ahead. Gotta slow him down. O'Brien, they're landing! Good. I have their coordinates now via your radio. You better go in on foot. On foot? Remember, you can't let them see you. O'Brien, I'm here. What do you want me to do? You want me to sneak into an LZ filled with heavily armed Kevlar wearing soldiers who shoot on sight so that you can spy on some asshole wearing a pocket protector? Pocket protector? Really? I have a fucking PhD, asshole. Yeah, which stands for piled high and deep. Do you still have the tracking devices I gave you? Well, I was gonna sell them, but most of us don't have access to shit like you know, satellites. Place one of them on their helo. Almost all of these filed missions include stops that aren't on the books. I'm gonna find out where they're going next. O'Brien. You don't need to ask. I'm already looking into what records we have about where evacuees were taken. O'Brien out. Okay. This just gotta be it. Might be a drifter in the LC. How the hell do I know? We'll find out when the docks finish. Looks like Randy and Jet.
while it was still alive. They're not my boys. And what do you care? Aren't you a... What do you guys like to call yourselves? Drifters? Don't you kill the infected for money or whatever shit you barter with? Yeah, I kill freaks, but I don't carve them open while they're still alive and listen to them scream. Did you get my data? Yeah, I got your data. Okay, I'm uploading it now. I'll be in touch. O'Brien out. Brian? O'Brien! God damn it, he did it again. O'Brien, well, talk to me. Ah, shit, you better be in touch, O'Brien. Hello, squatter camp. The sons of bitches have been setting up ambushes around here, yeah? This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. It's with a heavy heart. I report six deaths and two injuries from my camp this week. Not from the usual shit. It's those damn black choppers. Let me tell you, everything I've been wanting you Absolutely coming true. Where those choppers touched down and wiped out an entire group of men and women who were screaming and begging for mercy. Citizens of this country. And they cut them down. My men returned fire, but. Shit! This won't be the last we hear of them either. They're hunting us down. Those of us who dare to survive and mess with their plans. Okay, this has got to be us. So they can finally emerge from their gopher holes. She's got to be out here. Stay vigilant, people. And keep your eyes on the sky. This is Mark Cooper for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. <laughs>
Where are you, kid? You gotta be around here somewhere. Hey. Where the hell are you? Yeah. There's another nest. Yeah, let's burn it up.
Got it. Scrap. Here, yeah, this will do it. Inside here. Lisa's handwriting, I want to forget. <sighs> sounds like something she would write. <sighs> Not so hard. Came by to see how the lazy bastard's doing. How you doing, uh, booze man? Are you are you tired of laying around yet, boozer? Hey, uh, you can't be in come here, on, Deacon. Come on, hey, come what's on, going Deacon. on? How's he doing? He needs his rest. Uh, don't mess around with me, Addy. I asked you, how was he doing? I'm good. I'm good. Uh, Not good. Uh, damn, it's cold. The They're not enough. <laughs> Never enough. Oh, wait a second. You said that I, I said that we would try. <sighs> Look, all we can do is wait. Uh, okay. All right. Deacon. Deacon. No, Deacon. there's. Uh, you Deacon. know what? There's Deacon. something I can do Deacon. about this. Stop. I can get. Stop! What? I know you want to smash something. I see that look yes. in your eyes. But you know what? You go right ahead, but you do it out there. Daddy, go. I can... Look. <sighs> there is nothing else you can do. Please. Just go home. Go home, Deacon. Uh, Deacon, Deacon. So yeah, Schizo, he'll be fine. I just, he needs a few days. Come with me to the lodge. I want to show you something. I got shit to do. I'm sticking my neck out here. Trust me. You're gonna want to see this. Just, just listen. A couple of months back, this drifter comes into camp, telling all kind of crazy stories. Said he worked at the airport, was on the ground back in Farewell when shit went down. One night, they were expecting a flight in from Portland. Only it never shows up. The plane is doing a haul for the Red Cross. The Red Cross? Yeah. You getting it? Medicine, doctor shit, cargo hold full of it. Maybe even some of those uh, anti uh, whatever the fucks. Antibiotics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit like that. Just like that. Where? Hey, keep your voice down, will you? Let's talk inside. So this drifter. He's working in the control tower when the plane disappears off the radar. Poof. Now you see it, now you don't. 
Right about here, south of Mount Washington. That's what he said. It came down intact, a controlled crash or whatever. The guys got to listen to the pilot bleeding out from a broken pelvis on the ground. Okay, so you haven't sent anyone to find this? Nope. Why not? Because the old man won't have it. Iron Mike, what's the... Oh, right. Rippers. <laughs> you catch on quick. Everything west of the Iron Ridge here belongs to Carlos and his merry band of bald-headed freak-alikes. Oh, shit. So you go over there and you get caught. You head north, brother. Otherwise, Iron Mike's treaty with rest and peace goes... Okay. Yeah, Just no, like no, I get it, I get it. Let me ask you a question. Why are you telling me this? Oh, wait a minute. First off, I'm not telling you shit. You remember that? Second off, you're a goddamn drifter. What am I supposed to do? Follow you around like I'm your little bitch, keep your ass out of trouble? All right. I have things to do. I get it. You're just a regular stand-up guy, right, Schizo? Just trying to stay alive, like everybody else. <sighs> hey. You do what you gotta do. At the end of the day, that's all we got. Do you know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying, Schizo. Keep your radio close. I'll be in touch. <laughs>